Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to calculate the odds of winning the US Powerball. And uh, tonight there's the $1.5 billion US Powerball draw. And a lot of people are talking about it. Even people here in Australia are talking about it. So uh, I thought I'd show you how to, uh, to calculate the odds of winning it. So uh, basically uh, what you've got to do uh, to win it, you've got to select uh, five numbers from 69 in the first section. So I'm just going to randomly select um, five numbers. Um, and then on my grid here, that's I've got 69 numbers on this grid. And then on the Powerball section, you've got to select correctly select one number out of the uh, 26. So I'll select one number there. And then uh, when the uh, when the first ball drops, then you've got uh, 69 balls in the uh, in the drum, and you've got one, two, three, four. You've got five chances in 69. So I write that down there as a fraction. Five chances in 69 of um, getting the the first number correct as it comes out of the drum. And then when the next ball is uh, selected, then on your on your grid that you've marked, you've still got uh, four chances: one, two, three, four. Four numbers left out of four numbers actually out of. 68. So there's already one numbers come out of the drum. So then that leaves me with 68. Oops, put that down. 68 numbers left in the drum of uh, balls. Uh, so you've got four chances in 68 of the second um, number that comes down being on one of your five numbers that you've selected. And then when the third number comes down, one, two, three, you've left. You've got three chances or three numbers left on your grid out of, uh, and this time there's uh, 67 balls left in the drum because two have been selected, so you've got 67 uh, left, so you've got three chances in 67 of the uh, third number. And when the fourth number comes out, you've got one, two, two balls left on your grid that you've still got to match, so you've got two chances in this time 66. And then the last one, you've got one one number left on your grid to match out of a possible uh, 65 numbers now left in the drum, and so you've got one chance in 65. So that's the uh, that's the maths to uh, to work out the the first section to work out the odds, and then you see there I've written multiplication signs as I've gone through. So if we multiply all those uh, the numbers out five times four times three times two times one that gives a, the uh, a total of 120 and then if we multiply 69 times 68 times 67 times 66 times 65 that gives us the enormous number of one billion three hundred and forty eight million six hundred and twenty one thousand five hundred and sixty and if we express that as a ratio as one in, one chance in, at the moment we've got 120 chances in that 1.3 billion. So if we express that as one chance in something, so that's a matter of dividing the top and the bottom by the 120, that gives you one, and you divide the bottom by 120. So 1.3 odd billion divided by 120 gives you a figure of 11 million. Oops. 238,513. Yep. So that's uh, so you've got to, to get the five numbers in the first section, you've got one chance in 11 uh, million. But, but you've still got to match the uh, one ball in 26 to get the, uh, the Powerball section. So that's, uh, so that's one chance in in 26 again of getting the Powerball. So, let's get a separate sheet of paper. So then we have to multiply the one chance in 11 odd million, 238513, by one chance in 26, yep, to give us our final odds. So that gives us one chance in 
uh, 1, that's 11.2 million multiplied by 26 gives us 292 million. 201,338. So there we go. So the odds of um, correctly selecting five numbers in the first section. So there we go, the odds of selecting five numbers in the first section and the power one Powerball number in the Powerball section are one chance in 292 million. Good luck.